Hells and horns, everybody. Welcome back to the Abyss. I'm at Zagala. Been away for a little too long, so I'm back today with a black metal collection update. So stick around and check this shit out. All right, so at first we have a band that originated from Norway, as many great black metal bands did. Uh, this is Massimord. I believe that's how it's pronounced with Skogan collar. And this is the expanded third edition. So it's got quite a few bonus tracks. I don't know how well you can see that on the bottom, but you know, those last like four or five or so are all just bonus tracks. Really good, kind of mostly raw uh, black metal. Extremely riff driven though. So it's a lot more riffy, thrashy, you know, than, you know, straight up like old Dark Throw and things like that. But really, really good. Awesome vocals, great drums. And that, again, that, oh man, riffs for days with Massimord. So if you haven't checked them out, please do so. I know they started out in uh, Bergen, Norway, and moved around to like Italy, and I think they might be based out of Switzerland now. I'm not 100% on that. But yeah, definitely check out Massimord with Skogen Color. And uh, I don't think you'll be disappointed, especially if you're more into that riffy, chunky, guitar-driven type of black metal. But let's see what else we got for you. All right, so this next one's pretty interesting. Uh, I wanted to do a shout-out to Nick over at Death Like Reviews. I actually did a trade to pick this one up and been really happy with it. Super good album. Uh, and this is Untold by The Shadow Order. Very, very good black metal out of Greece. Very raw, visceral, very primitive, but at the same time extremely riffy and powerful. Um, that kind of higher pitched, very raw sound to it. Um, and a lot of people look down on this band because some of their, their themes and stuff, you know, war, hate. And there's definitely some NS attributes in here, but um, very solid stuff. Just listen to it for what it is. Fucking amazing guitar riffs. The vocals are absolutely insane. Um, again, these guys are from Greece. Uh, not a whole lot of black metal bands that I know from Greece, so I was definitely interested when I saw he had this one up for trade and not disappointed at all. It's, it's definitely up there with some of my favorite uh, raw black metal albums that I've gotten into recently. Again, that is Untold by the Shadow Order. Definitely go check them out. All right, so this next one, for anybody that's been with my channel since the beginning, uh, you'll definitely have seen me talk about these guys. Well, I should say this guy several times. Um, I've gotten everything he's released um, through this title and, you know, a lot of merch, patches, shirts, pins, buttons, everything. So very, very, very underground, very raw, but killer black metal out of Kentucky. Uh, that is Brood in Black with his new 2019 release, Unholy Infernal Rites. And again, very do-it-yourself, you know, everything is hand-drawn, hand-written, uh, cut, copy, paste, <laughs> just sick stuff. Here's the cassette itself. It's a blank white and again, hand-drawn, hand-written, uh, made some labels to put on the other side. Very, very cool stuff. Um, he releases his stuff on his own record label which is blasphemous records and you can see here it's uh, bro5 and i got copy number two very very cool stuff um you can see the inside of the j card just blank but then you got um some band photos um and i was mistaken this is one of the albums he did when he had the drummer full time but yeah really really cool stuff kind of got a little explanation of where and how it was written just very, very sick stuff, man. Very good. If you love, if you love that early, you know, second wave uh, style of black metal, definitely go check these guys out. Um, does all this stuff. One of the hardest workers in in the genre for sure. But yeah, Brood and Black, you can never go wrong with him. Fantastic EP to go along with the amazing collection. Um, you can see these cassettes up here. Almost all of those are you know different versions of previous Brood and Black releases. So definitely go check them out. Definitely going to be linked up in the comments below and see what you've been missing out on. But let's see what else we got. All right, so this next one I probably never would have heard of if it wasn't for Eddie from Desolation and Vanda. So huge shout out to you, brother. Um, he mentioned on, I believe we were just talking in chat on Facebook, and he brought this up because one of the videos that I did, he said, hey, if you like this band, definitely check them out. And wow, yeah, blown away. This is the 2019 EP from... Malakim, I believe that's how you say that. But yeah, really good EP. Uh, if you're into black metal bands like, you know, um, Dark Funeral, things like that, 
Svinger. You're definitely gonna definitely gonna dig these guys, man. Very heavy, fast, brutal. I mean, your your typical Swedish black metal, man. Like I said, very much in the vein of dark. Uh, sorry, dark funeral. Black behind the tray there. Nothing too fancy, but yeah, very very punchy, well produced, very heavy stuff. Again, for band, if you like Svinger and Dark Funeral, definitely check these guys out. Um, I think that's the JJ. I think that's just uh, kind of like similar to a Roman numeral for two. So I'm assuming that's the name of this. Because I think it was Demo 1 and then EP 2. But yeah, Killer 2019 release. Definitely don't sleep on this one if you can get your hands on it. Again, click on the link below. See if it's something you're into. But otherwise, let's keep on rolling and see if I got something else for you. All right, so already in this video once, I talked about how I didn't have a whole lot of black metal from Greece, um, but here is another one, and this is another fantastic release. I actually got this for free. I did an order from, I think, Forever Plagued uh, not too long ago, and this is one a freebie that was in it. And this is Cult of Taurus with Adversarial Paths, the Sinister Essence. Very, very good black metal out of Greece. Um... Just had to double check, there's the Forever Plague logo. So yeah, this is one of the freebies that I got from that. Um, killer stuff, man. Um, very good, you know, occult, I would say. Occult driven uh, black metal. Um, love that logo underneath there. Very cool looking stuff. Um, trying to stay away from that glare. It's pretty, I got a really bright light over here. Um, so I was working on a project behind me. And too lazy to get up and turn it off before filming this video, but yeah. Um, I would say if you're into bands like um, Cult of Azazel, maybe give these guys a try. Uh, really sick stuff. Um, so a lot of good tracks on here. Uh, Black Embrace was probably my favorite one. Um, Vibrating, Vibrating Crossroads probably my second favorite. But very, very good stuff. Very interesting sound. Uh, kind of unique in a lot of ways. So definitely go check out Cult of Taurus if you have not. And especially this one. This was their 2015 full length, like I said, the Sinister Essence Adversarial Paths. Sick shit. Down to one more uh, one more album to show you, and then we'll call this a video, guys. All right, so lastly, I have a 7-inch um, EP to show, and it's something that I bought quite a long time ago on the last big Dark Descent record sale, and it's just been sitting here, and I completely forgot about it. I was actually getting the stuff ready for the video I'm going to film after this, and saw this and threw it on and was pleasantly surprised uh, so I'm glad I came across this again uh, this is Susperial with the um, the EP sorry from 2015 Dawn of Kazef you can see it's side B there really solid black and death metal out of Spain um, for the most part pretty straightforward with you know most black death metal uh, this is a really heavy for a 7 inch so very good thick quality um, anyway like I was saying pretty straightforward black and death but it does have its own little twist to it it's very occult feeling uh kind of like wolves winter um if they were more black and death um if you'd seen them on my channel too but yeah really solid stuff so i'm glad i kind of accidentally ordered this in the first place and then glad i just found it out of nowhere and gave it a spin and it was really good so that that, that side b track um dawn of kazef was freaking killer Definitely go check out Suspirial. I believe that's how you say that. I apologize if I'm wrong. But, yeah, sorry guys. I've kind of jumbly and rumbled through this video, but it has been a while other than, you know, talking about my demo, things like that, and the project Vanta Black's Cat, my Born of Seth. Uh, stay tuned. Really soon, the, the physical copies are on their way. So if you're interested in picking one of those up, hit me up on Facebook. Let me know in the comments. Um, but that's it. I got a couple collection updates coming really soon, and we'll see you then. Hails and horns.